and a good Friday morning. It's the 8th day of July, 2022. Um, well, how about that big win by the Dodgers over the Cubs yesterday, 5-3? to three. We play the Cubs again tonight with Tyler Anderson pitching and, and tomorrow and today the Orioles play the Angels as well. And um, also in, well, the Padres walked it off last night in extra innings with a two to one win over the hated Giants. So, well, this weekend, I'll make an, I'll, I'll make an exception. Let's root for the Padres this weekend because we all hate the Giants, most of us. But, um, but yeah, go Padres this weekend. And of course, go Dodgers. And well, the Angels are, um, they're pretty much out of playoff contention the way things are. They're just playing for pride. And yeah, with the firing of Joe Madden, you know, and it's just another lost year for the Halos. And unfortunately, we all know about Houston and, of course, the Yankees and the Mets, but the Braves are catching up to the Mets right now, too. Yeah, I, I wouldn't be surprised that the Braves pass new, the Mets. Uh, the, the Yankees should be comfortable, but we all got to fight for home field advantage. Yeah, home field advantage is important when it comes to, like, the playoffs and the World Series, you know. Well, the Yankees already have like 60 wins. And uh, yeah, but like I told you earlier, the best record in baseball doesn't really mean anything. I mean, we already know about the Mariners of 01. And of course the 98 Yankees that won 114 games was the, probably the greatest team of all time. Yeah, of course you have the 98 Yankees, the 1986 Mets, they won 108 games. And the 1975 Cincinnati Reds that also won 108 games. And the 61 Yankees that won 109 games. And the 27 Yankees that won 110. I mean, those are the greatest teams of all time. That means they won all those games and they, they finished the job, you know. Be yeah. Those were like the greatest teams of all time. Could you put these year's Yankees up there too? But we'll just wait and see how they do in the playoffs because I know they're going to make the postseason. As as will the Dodgers. And unfortunately, the Astros will be there too. And Braves will probably be back there. Cardinals and Brewers are fighting it in the NL Central. The AL Central, it's Minnesota and, and uh, Cleveland. But... And then, of course, yeah, Mets and Braves will probably be in the playoffs, either as a division winner or a wild card. The Padres should probably get in this year, but the Giants are fading. Yeah. Yeah. The way the A's are and Mariners are playing, it's pretty disappointing. The Mariners will likely miss the playoffs for like the 22nd straight year. Yeah, the Mariners never recovered after that. Well, happy birthday is going out to Kevin Bacon, Beck Hansen, the late Billy Eckstein, also to Toby Keith and to um, Alan Ashby. Also a happy birthday is going out to Jason Soames and to uh, Will Jam. Um, yeah, well, it's overcast right now. Yeah, we've had nice weather so far this month in the coastal regions, but out in the valleys, it's been smoking hot. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, well, let's hope that the Dodgers get another win and keep adding to their lead in the division. And I'll catch you all later. Amen.